Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So in the last lesson, what did we cover? We started covering the shibhul jumla, the prepositions. Okay, and a preposition is a phrase. Oh, sorry, preposition is a phrase, and phrase are what? Expansion of nouns. So, phrases, quick recap, matin arab, the conjunctive phrase, ma'atufun alayhi, ha'arfu'at, ma'atuf, those are the buddies. Then the positive phrase, mubdal min huandi, badal. Then you have the matin ding, super buddies, the man'ut na'at, and the ismu ishara, musharun ilayh. Then we had the, the ones that don't match are the mudhafun ilay, mudhaf and mudhafun ilay. We call those the naughty enemies. And the last one that we did was what? The loonies. The prepositional phrase. What do we do? The prepositional phrase. Which are what? The mudhaf, mudhaf ilay. Only when the mudhaf is what? Shows time and place. And then the harfun jar and the majroor. Okay? Now why I call these the loonies? I said yeah, there's a loonies in prison. You only let them out at certain times. So you let them out once in the morning and once in the evening. evening. So the prepositional phrase, the naughty, the naughty enemies are, it's a bit naughty, but you can let them go, you can let them come to everywhere. But the loonies, they have, they're just too dangerous. You only keep them in particular places. One, one place in Jumla Ismiya, or one place in Jumla Fa'liya. In the prison, something they get one time in the morning to walk, or one time in the afternoon for a walk. So the, the Shibul Jumla, the prepositional phrase, they're only allowed to come out twice from the prison. How many times? Twice. Once in Jumla Ismiya, once in Khalas. You following? That's why the loonies are in prison. So in Jumla to Ismiya, so a recap, these are the phrases. So the first type is a mudaf, mudaf, ilay structure with all of these words. And the second type was, the second type was fi, ila, ala. So the A team and the B team. The A team was the nouns which have the verb, uh, noun meaning. And the second was, the hawruf, hawruf al jarra. Okay? You with me? The shibul jumla shows time and place. Two types. Team A with nouns, which become mudaf, mudaf ilay, and team B, which is the hawruf al jarra. Okay? You have to learn these in your own time the other lesson. Okay? Yes. Everybody following me? Yeah. Okay. Now moving on. Yeah. Yeah. Moving on. Uh, we saying here that because these are the loonies, these are what? Uh, in prison, we only let them out how many times? Twice. Once in Jumla Ismiya and once in Jumla Pa'liya. All the other phrases were good people, they're free. They're unrestricted. What are they? They're unrestricted. A phrase can come wherever any noun goes. No restriction, not in prison. Where are they? What are they? Free, unrestricted. They can come as a fa'il, a maf'ul bihi. Maf'ul bihi thani, maf'ul fi, or a hal. It comes as a mubtada, it comes as a khabar. The loonies we say no. The shibul jumla we say what? The shibul jumla is just morning once and evening once. One place in jumla ismiya and one place in jumla fa'liya. Nowhere else. We don't want them anywhere else. So they are what? So the, these are restricted phrases. The shibul jumla is what? Restricted phrase. It comes where? Only two places, not everywhere. Don't let it go everywhere. Where does it go? Two places. So all the other phrases are what? What are they? Unrestricted. The shibul jumla is restricted. In a jumla ismiya, in a jumla ismiya, the shibul jumla can come as a khabar. That's it. Nowhere else. Don't let it be mubtada. Okay? It can only be the khabar. So for example here, in the bab. What's the in the means by? So in the bab is a shibul jumla. So if we do turkeep of this, we say here, the man is by the door. Correct? So this is mubtada. This is what? Khabar. Mubtada and khabar. And in the bab is going to be what? Is this team A preposition or team B preposition? Team A. So it's going to be ism, isn't it? So it's going to be mudaf. This is going to be mudafun. Ilayhi. Correct? What did I tell you? Prepositions are what? Prepositions are? The loonies. They did they, in prison. Like, it's hard to control them. What's a khabar supposed to be? What's the say? What's the arab of a khabar? Marfu. The loonies say no, we don't need marfu. So just leave them. So when a shibu jumla comes as a, as a khabar, they don't become marfu. They have the mansub. You see? 
because they, they're in prison, they don't listen to any rules, they're really hard to control, so we just try to keep them however we can. How, when they come out as a, as a, as a khabar, they're a bit naughty, we just let them be mansoon and put them back inside prison again. But they can be, they, so khabar, all khabars are, what? Well, except these guys. Just, just, just be with them. What can you do? They cannot listen to us. The, the nice one, the buddy is super, but they're very nice, and they listen to you in the Arab, in Ding. But the Muzafila is a bit, well, they're not too bad, but the, the Shibu Jumla, they're a bit weirdos. Yeah, so we just say what? They're Mansub, so we leave them as Mansub. Are you following me? Yes? So what will happen here? Ar Rajul Mubtada. And even though it has a Fatha and is Mansub, it becomes the Khabar. And they say Mudaf Mudafili. Do you understand? And another example, this is Team B Harfunjar. So Ar Rajul is Mubtada. And Fir Rajul becomes the Khabar. But this is what kind of, this is Team B. So this is going to be what? Jarun and Majroorun becomes what? Become the khabar. Jumla ismiya. The man is in the masjid. So here. Mubtada khabar, but because it's team B, you don't call it what? Mudaf, you call it what? Jaran Majroor. It's the same thing in terms of meaning. But it's just the Arabs have done it differently. So we have to call it that way. Everybody following me? Okay. Let's try doing this one now. So we got now we're using the Shibul Jumla in a sentence. Do you read it? Bismillah. Al Ka'batu fil Masjid al Haram. How do you translate this? Haram is sacred, yes. The Ka'ba. The Ka'ba is in the sacred Masjid. The Tarkib. Ka'ba is Mubtada. And then. Fil Masjid al Haram is the. Khabar. Is there any phrases in here? Uh, uh, uh. Mm-hmm. Fi is, is jar. Fi is jar. al haram is majroor. And then al al haram, what's the, what's the uh, thing of this? Man'ud. And al haram is the not. Um, uh, you said before that Mubtada is Marifa. Very good question. The question is, these are loonies, isn't it? The question is that the Khabar is supposed to be Marifa and Nakira. Nakira, but remember Mudaf Ilay, the naughty, and the Shibul Jumla are loonies. So when the, when the, the Shibul Jumla or the Mudaf, Mudaf Ilay come as a Khabar, they don't follow the rules a bit. They're naughty and they're loony, so you just leave them alone. So good question, good, very good question. The question was, why is it ma'arifa? Why is it aliflam in here? Because the mudaf mudaf ilayya and the shibul jumla don't like following rules. It's only the buddies and super buddies, the nice children, they, they follow the rules. Yes? Let's do the next one now. Your turn. Who wants to do it? You want to do it? Bismillah. Good. Inna allaha ma'al muttaqeen. In nice. Harfun Mushabbahun Bil Fa'li. Then what do you have to look for? Ismu inna is what? Loves Allah. The word Allah is Ismu. Ismu inna is what? Khabar inna. And what's Khabar inna made up of? Mudaf. And mudafun ilay. Mudafun and mudafun. You got it? So indeed, Allah is with the muttaqin is what? God fearing. Okay. Next one. A bit longer. How do you do it? Al waladu sagir bain al ummi bain al abi wal ummi. G. G. Correct. Al Walu Sahir is the Mubtada and the Bayin al Abi wal Ummi is the Khabar. And then Al Walu Sahir, what kind of structure is this? Man'ud. Na'at. And then Bayin al Abi wal Ummi is what? One type of phrase or two phrases? Two. So let's go one level down. What's the, what's the main phrase first that would make up the whole Khabar? 
Bayna becomes a Mudaf and that becomes the Mudaf Ilayi and then this becomes what? and ab becomes Ma'tufun Alayhi and the am becomes Ma'tuf You see? Yes, you following? The next one G. Yeah, turn, yeah. الماء البارد والتمرة الحلوة للولد الصائم الماء البارد والتمرة الحلوة is the مبتدأ very good and then للولد الصائم is the خبر and then what's the mean if you don't, Manu'u not going to take the whole phrase up. Yeah, you should hear Ma'tufun Ali. Ma'tufun Ali. And then. Sorry, my mistake. Ma'tufun Ali. Still here, Ma'tuf Ali. Harfu Atf, and then. Ma'tuf. And then, the Ma'tuf Ali is what? Manu'ut. Not. And here's also. Manu'ut. Not. And then Lilwali Sa'imi. Lam is harfun jar. And then what's majroor? Walli Sa'im is majroor. And what's the structure of Walli Sa'im? Man'ut. Not. Yeah. So, we've done all of these. We've got quite a few times. So we have the phrases, the ones that match in ding, the buddies, super buddies, the naughty enemies, and now we have the the loonies. So you, you see why I call them loonies? Because they can't, they have enough, they, they, they break many rules and you can only let them out at two times. One is in Jumla Ismiya. And the Jumla Fa'liya, they'll do in the next lesson, inshallah. Subhanallah, bihamdi, subhanakallahumma, bihamdi, kawna, shadallah, illa illa, 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 illa